What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If you are new, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. If you're a returning guest, you know how we do kick off our shoes, like, and share the video. This video is under the Fear You Stack, and the Fear You Stack is in the description box of the video, as well as the About Me section of the platform. The Fear You Stack is used to educate you guys on what we are covering on this particular platform. And please keep in mind that this video is a legend. Well, looks like the circus is fully up and running. It seems like everybody is back except Jaden. <laughs> What's that about? But we're going to get into that on another day this week. We got Carlissa is upset with Dre. She feels like Dre is ungrateful. You know, he sold the car that she brought him or whatever the case. But I feel like this. I feel like when Dre was going through his spiral and out, whatever the case, first Carlos was telling everybody else to pray for him and this and that. But yet she was all over the place and just talking crazy and nonsense. And so, like, where, what were you doing while he was all over the place? Like, you knew that he was going through something. But, again, jump out there and tell the world all the kids' business. And this is why the kids, her kids are just so disappointed with a lot of her actions because it seems like she do the wrong things the wrong way at the wrong time most of the time. So they're just really sick of it, you know. Dre is saying she's a psycho, you know, and all these different things. And it's like, I mean, when will it stop with them? She said she was going to get off them. Um, she said she was going to get off of Instagram, but she's on Instagram like more than ever. So make that make sense. So now Dre is calling her out and saying what it is he feel about his mom. And some are saying, well, you know, he shouldn't be doing that. That's his mom. Others are saying, well, what about the mom misbehaving? And so there are a lot of mixed feelings about what's going on with them. Blueface is making his calls on the regular, it seems like. And so everybody's excited and Krishan's excited and... Hey, like I said, as long as everybody know that all is well and that he's okay and healthy, I guess for the most part, that's really all that matters. Because at the end of the day, like I said, when he go out, come out, she could be going in. Then they got all these bills, all these lawsuits, all this other stuff going in. So I think even though now they're still worrying about the wrong things, they have much bigger things to deal with. You know, whether they ready to face it or ready not to face it. We got K-Swab on his new song. People are saying that he shaded Chris Sean because he stated like he can't control anybody, you know, putting his name on their body or whatever the case. However, he started showing pictures of people that are fans doing the same thing, a.k.a., you know, it's not Chris Sean talking about it. You know, my thing is this. She did do it. I mean... And if he's showing pictures of other people doing it, I absolutely seen no other pictures until he did the song that he wanted to show people. I didn't see him tag anybody. You know, like Krishan, the little girl did the tattoo. She tagged her and all those kind of things. And so I didn't see him doing those same things. And so what led people to believe that he was shading Krishan about writing her name on his name on her body? But, you know, she writes anybody's name on her body. I don't know what's wrong with this child. She thinks a tattoo was the way of showing somebody you loved them. That's crazy. Just love them. Either they're going to receive you or they're not. That's it. You know, and so definitely a lot going on. It looks like, again, the circuit is up and running. And, whew, still got the dad in them out there. And that's some other stuff. But we're going to get into all that. Just give me a couple of days. And, um, yeah, thank you guys for subscribing, loving on the channel. Do you guys think that Dre is a writer? Do you guys think that Jay is purposely just doing what he's doing to keep things going, to keep the light on his family because Blueface isn't here to do it? Do you guys feel like that Dre is trying to fill in the social media gap for Blueface until Blueface come on? Could he be stepping up and being a bigger person and just keeping the family alive? Hey, that's kind of what I'm seeing here. Because just like with Blueface and Carlissa, when Blueface say something, here come Carlissa. When Carlissa say something, but well, Blueface haven't really been saying nothing when she's been saying something lately. So Dre might be messing up a little bit because Blueface hasn't been giving her no attention. <laughs> he just haven't. You know what I mean? 
But yeah, I f I'm feeling like that's what Dre is doing, He's trying to keep the family, you know, name alive, trying to keep them in the viral status, whatever the case. Anyway, let me know what you guys think. My channel, hit the like button, like, share, subscribe to the channel. Be blessed. Later.